What's going on YouTube? Brian Big Guy here. Today I've got a full review of the Tune Band for the iPhone 4. Um, I got my iPhone 4 right here, got the Tune Band right here, and if you don't know what the Tune Band is for the iPhone 4, um, specifically, it is an armband that allows you to strap your iPhone 4 to your arm. Now, just because it's called an armband doesn't mean you have to strap it to your armband, you can strap it to pretty much anything you want. So, this is an armband. Now, what this is going to do for you, um, I'm going to, so I'm going to do a review on this. Now, basically, this is a great armband. Now, there's several armbands out there, many to choose from, but this one particular works well. Um, to start off with, it's got a Velcro thing on the back here. Take a look at that. Um, fully adjustable, as you can see. You can pull the entire strap out of the case if you want for cleaning. All right, and it just goes right back in. Um, two little slits on the back of the iPhone 4. Still, you've got that camera ability right there. I'm not sure. Um, I think what you can do is if you wanted to use this separately as a case, you could. But um, I personally wouldn't use it as a case because it, you know, it's it's not a case. It's it's an armband in my opinion. Um, so just gonna slip that right back in there. Um, very easy to set up. Like I said, you just put that in there. You can uh, you can fully adjust it just by slipping it through that part. And uh, depending on how tight you want it on your arm, you then can Velcro it shut. Now I'll actually uh, go ahead and put it on my arm for you so we can do the rest of the review. Thought I'd uh, show you me putting it on. So first off, I'm gonna put the iPhone 4 in the case. Okay, so that's that's an easy process. As you can see, um, full support for the proximity sensor, front-facing camera, speaker, home button at the bottom. You know, you got your little volume buttons on the side. You got your uh, little switch. But other than that, it's, it's pretty simple on um, the strap. Now I'm going to go ahead and put it on my arm. Basically, you just kind of uh, put it on. Um, try to get low here for you guys. Um, basically, at that point, you would be able to uh, adjust it to however tight you want. Now, because I do run, I, I did go running with this band a few times. So it, this is going to be a great case for runners. Um, you, I had it pretty tight, so I can run like this. Now you take a look, it works very easily, um, moving your arms, you know, it doesn't slide, it doesn't wobble everywhere, it stays tight to your arm, and that's an important um, feature um, with this case. Some armbands, uh, the iPhone wobbles around everywhere while you're running, and that's annoying. Like, I can actually run and trust that my iPhone's going to stay in place, it's going to stay protected, and it's not going to be uncomfortable to wear. Um, as for headphones with this, you know, I just use the traditional Apple headphones. There's a little headphone jack at the top, and I was able to just run that actually through my shirt up to my ears. And, uh, yeah. So, um, downside to this case is that it's not waterproof at all. If you're the kind of person who runs outdoors, you might, um, you might experience some rain or something. Um, so you do need to be more planned. Um, you probably could... Um, put your iPhone in a plastic bag under this and then slip it into this case and it could be okay. Um, I don't know how that would work with the headphones though sticking out and whatnot. Um, so waterproof is a no-no. You can't do anything. Um, sweat, okay. I, I sweat a lot when I run, okay. Uh, I was in an indoor gym. I did not go running outside. Um, in my opinion, you have to be crazy to go running outside in Florida during the summer. So that's definitely not me got a text, um, it's definitely not something I would ever do, um, so I went to the gym, I went running at the gym, and, uh, let's get rid of that, and, uh, I went running at the gym, and I did sweat in, in the gym, so, regular, um, sweating in the gym on a treadmill, and you'll notice, because those two slits are still, um, open on the bottom here, and the camera also, you might get a, just a little sweat on the back of your iPhone, um, during the usage of this case on your running thing. Now, the, the case actually does come with two screen protectors, one for the front and one, actually, for the entire back of your iPhone. Now, because I hate screen protectors, none of them are applied on mine. Um, I actually attempted to put the one on the back and I attempted to put the one on the front. 
I am horrible with screen protectors. Let's make it so you can see my face again. I am horrible with screen protectors. So it was a no-go for me. You know, bubbles everywhere all over the screen. Not my style. I think screen protectors kind of ruin the whole usability and niceness and, I don't know, the kind of clean feeling you get from the phone. Um, without it, it's just nicer to me. And a little sweat on the back really is not going to hurt your phone. I've gotten sweat on the back of this phone. You get home, you just wipe it off with like a sponge or something and you're good to go. This case, really easy to clean. Um, you could clean it like anything. I have not put it in the washing machine, but you might be able to do that would not dry it. Um, you can, I mean, what, what I've done to clean it is just put it in the sink, soak it in some soapy water, take it out, you know, scrub it a little bit with a, you know, a sponge covered in soap. Easy cleanup. So, all in all, this is a great case. Um, does it provide the protection while you run? Um, with that screen protector, and as you can see, that's what the case looks like. It's protecting the edges of your phone. It's protecting the back of your phone for the most part without, you know, those two slits. Um, back here. However, it's not going to protect your screen unless you use their provided screen protector. No case is ever going to protect your screen um, except for OtterBox. They have the built-in screen protector. Now, there isn't any um, armband that works with the OtterBox that I know of. Um, OtterBox isn't waterproof either. So, um, I, I don't know if there's anything else I want to tell you about this other than uh, protection is good, not waterproof like I said before. There are waterproof cases out there. But, I don't know. Check them out if you want to, but I, I really do like this case. They're going to cost you a bit more, I think. Um, this, I can't even remember how much it costs. I'll put a little annotation right here telling you how much it costs. But, my bad for not knowing that um, during this video. But that is the review for the case. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Um, be sure to check the comments also below um, in case somebody asked a question that you're, you want to ask too and that I may have already answered it because I'm probably not going to answer the same thing twice. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe above if you like this review. If you want to check out the unboxing of this tune band and where you can see everything that comes with it, you can see both those screen protectors that I pulled out of the box. Um, check it out. There'll be a little link over here on the side. Um, all in all, thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.